Welcome to the help video of BS XBRL. XBRL is the most easy and convenient way to convert financials into XBRL mode. Let's start with the software. First you need to create a company. Click on create new company tab. This page of company master would get open. You are required to enter sin of the company and click prefill. When you click on prefill button, the software would fetch the information about the company's profile from MCA portal. You are now required to create a login and password for the company. Also provide the PAN number for the company and click on save button. This way the company would get created. Now select the company from the drop down and enter the ID and password that you have created and click on login button. You are required to select the financial year from here for which the conversion is to be done. Click on OK button. Now this is the home page of the software which displays the process flow of XBRL. It indicates that how the process of XBRL works starting from creation of the master data and ending with the validation tool. Let's start with the XBRL conversion. The first tab available is masters. To start with master, there is a company master through which you can either add a company or modify any existing company. Next there is director master. Here you are required to enter the particulars of the directors of the company. Our software provides with the option of autofill through which the details of the directors would get directly fetched from the MCA portal. As these details get directly fetched from the MCA portal, we only need to select the names of the directors who are associated with us for that financial year for which the conversion is to be done in XPRL mode and click on the save button. The information that we saved can be seen here in the list. Also we can add the name of a director using the prefill option. For that we need to provide the, DIN ident the director's identification number and click on prefill. Our software would directly fetch the details from MCA and you only need to provide details like gender, designation, state and save the information. Next we have document master. Through document master you can upload excel or word file of your financial statement. For uploading the file you need to click on the upload button and you can browse your desired file and upload it in the software. Once the file get uploaded you can start with financial tagging. Next option we have is directors report. Here we fill details about our shareholding pattern like top 10 shareholder, change in promoter shareholding etc. Now we come to share capital. Here we can see various disclosures regarding the share capital are to be given like detail of share capital, reconciliation statement of share outstanding etc. Let's fill the detail of share capital. Here you need to select the share capital and select the year. Enter the number of shares. Enter nominal value. You can see the total value is automatically calculated by the software. After filling in the information we will save it. The same is to be done for the previous year.
we will save the information. We can see our saved information is visible here. After director master, there is auditor master where we are required to provide the details of the auditor like auditor's firm name, signing report name, address, membership number, PAN number. Next we have narration master which provides us with the feature of creating a shortcut key for certain contents which we might need to write again and again in the software. For example, I am creating a key F10 as a shortcut for not applicable and saving it. Now next time whenever I need to write not applicable in the software, I can simply press key F10. Next comes the option of change year. While working in a particular file, we might need to open the same company for previous year. We will simply click on change year and we can change the year here and provide our login password and login into the previous year. Our next option is of log off. If you need to log in an another company, all you need to do is log off from here and log in to your desired company.